guys and welcome back to my channel. Obviously we are here at the teacher's lounge because we are going to do another fidget shopping challenge. Today is going to be animals only. So that means that it could be like aquatic animals, land animals, farm animals. I'm not gonna include insects in this challenge, just animals. And just so you guys know, if you wanna shop at Fidget Headquarters but you don't live in St. Louis, you can go to fidget-hq.com and you can shop the site there. I think they just added like hundreds of fidgets and if you use code Sierra, you will get 10% off. So let's go inside and see how many animal themed fidgets we can find. We are gonna grab our basket and I am already seeing a needle right here. It is the Diggy Needle. This is the Dig It Pig. Look at how many colors they have. I wish they had the pink, but we will settle for the purple. And we now have our first animal fidget. I don't think there are any other needles over here, but I did find some barnyard animals and a little corgi. Oh, obviously we gotta get, oh wait, I already said no bugs. So he's not gonna count, but this guy is gonna count. Look at how cool this shark is. It's just like this, but a shark form. So we'll have to do another challenge where I can get like insects because this is gonna have to count for now. I did just find this poppet purse and it's on sale and that is a duck. So that is totally gonna count. And then while we're over here, there's also this duck pop it backpack and it is on sale as well. These are really big. So I'm gonna pull these out and leave them to the side and we will just remember to count those at the very end. They have all of these brand new putties. Unfortunately, I do not think any of them are animal themed and look at all of these brand new dope slimes they just got. We're gonna have to do a food one and definitely get some of these. I have a series going on right now where I am mixing together all of the slimes from certain stores. So I already did five below. I've got Nicole Jacqueline coming out. So maybe I need to do like a dope slime collection from the teacher's lounge. That would be so fun. And it'd give me an excuse to get every single one of these. Oh, this is a frog. It is an ooey gooey large frog and it definitely counts because amphibians, is that an amphibian? It's an animal either way. Down here, I do not see anything else. I mean, that is called a monkey noodle. So I feel like if we wanted to get technical, we could count it, but I am going to be a purist here and I will stick to the theme. But here is a, I was about to say penguin. You certainly are not a penguin. You are a flamingo. Here is a flamingo puppet pencil and in the basket it goes. Over here, I do not see any more animal fidgets, but I just have a feeling that that table is going to be a good one. I don't know if this counts as a fidget, but as an LCD writing tablet, it is so stinking cute and it is animal themed. So we are going to count it because it is technically here in the fidget store. And um, a funny story about these, I didn't realize they were battery powered. So Charlie opened it up while we were in the car to try to write on it and I thought it didn't work. So I ended up opening up like 10 of these to try to find one that worked. Turns out there's just an on and off switch on the back. So I was extra for no reason. So if you take that out of the package and you try to write on it and it's not working, try turning it on. It worked for me. These are infinity cubes and fidget pads and none of them are animal themed, but here we are ladies and gentlemen, tangles. And these are the aquatic tangle pets. And these are definitely animals. So which one should we get? I think we're gonna have to make AJ happy and get the Norwalk because that is definitely one of his favorites as AJ would say, look at that little face. How would you say no to that? In this little section right here, I already see a, another frog. Frogs are a very popular fidget animal. And here, ooh, are dinosaurs animals? I mean, I know they're extinct, but how cute is that? And while we're here, we will see if we can, yes, we will grab one of these octopus spinning up poppers. There we go. That was really hard. I will not be able to do that any longer, but our basket is getting so full. Here is a unicorn. These guys are adorable. Look at his little wings, his little mane, a little horn. So cute. One thing I'm really excited about is this back wall because these are all stress balls and so many stress balls come in animal forms. So let's see how full this basket's going to get. The easiest way to do this is to just go column by column. And here is a lizard. It is stretchy. 
It's got beads inside. It's very satisfying. And then here are balloon pets. So this one is a monkey, definitely counts. These snappers don't, but here's a unicorn. This little lady is coming home with us. That doesn't count. And oh, what are these? <gasps> these are brand new and so cute. Let's get the unicorn because it is so stinking adorable. These are all food fidgets, so those will have to stay for another challenge, but we've got some colorful wiggle worms. This is a um, water snake, water snake, yes, but it has dinosaurs in it, so we will count that. We have the dinosaur version of these, so now let's get the, what is this, dragon version. So should we get the red one, or should we get the green one? Looking at the basket, I feel like the green kind of matches the aesthetic right now. So let's do that. We've got more food. That's a banana. Ooh, this is an animal mochi. I don't know what this animal is, but he's definitely an animal. Oh, these are like all little dinosaurs. Charlie said his dream fidget was a dinosaur mochi. So we are definitely gonna have to add one of those to the collection. Here are some kitty cats. I think this guy is super cute. Look at those eyes, love it. And here are more puppets. This one is a shark, so he totally counts. We are definitely finding so many animal fidgets. Oh my gosh, look at these. These are new. They are stress planet balls. <gasps> this would have been really fun for my galaxy video that I did on TikTok. Unfortunately, we are not doing galaxy today. Oh my gosh, what is that a cat? A mouse? What does that say? Gummy, gummy bears? Well, I was really far off with that, but I love this purple, so we will include him in our basket. And here's a Swedish fish and another dinosaur. This is like that one frog I showed you guys. Squishy and satisfying. Here are some more sea creatures. I probably could have done an entire sea creature only video, but I lumped them in with the animals. So we are finding so, so many. Oh my gosh. Okay, here are some more caterpillars. Excuse me, sir, you actually belong in there. Here is a unicorn noodle. These have eyes and look animal-ish, but they're definitely not an animal, more of a creature, so we will not count him. Here are some more sea creatures. This is like an Orby-filled fish. These are Orby-filled dinosaurs, Orby-filled unicorn. Monsters don't count, but dragons do count. Make it make sense, you can't, but it's my challenge, so that's what we're going with. More balloon animals. It's a balloon animal dog, so it totally counts. Here is a sea creature with little like fish inside of it, water snake. This basket is getting so full, we might have to get another one. Again, dragons count, so do squirrels. I wish I could pop this out for you guys but we'll put him in there as well. And then here is another dinosaur, a finger snake. Ooh, this worm does not count. Oh, wait, wait. So that means the caterpillar doesn't count. Go back, go back. You gotta take out this caterpillar and you gotta take out this caterpillar. Those don't count. Oh no, you guys should have told me that. Okay, we'll put you back. Okay, but that one counts because it's a unicorn but this one doesn't count because it's a caterpillar and we are not doing insects this time. I think that was the only time I messed up. Now we gotta shove all this back in there. Get it all in there, there we go. That gave us a little bit more room, but I think that is everything over here. Oh, here's another dinosaur. This one spits out glitter. And this one is a pooping dinosaur. It's a dinosaur that poops. That is so interesting. We're getting them. This is called a animal puffs. So if it's called an animal puff, that makes it an animal. So we're gonna get him. Here is a unicorn and some more kitty cats. And I think guys, I think our basket is full. So now it's time to get our second basket. And here's our second basket. And we're gonna fill it with the first one for this round. It is an octopus, an octo snap, which means it's an octopus. As always, this wall will only count as one. So let's find the one animal we want to get. Let's go with the unicorn. <gasps> oh, we've gotten this unicorn before. Let's get this unicorn. This is a really fun shape and I love the color of this. That is adorable. It's so like unintentionally becoming like a green basket and that one looks like very pink and orange. Over here, 
I do know that there is this unicorn. And then these Poland Pops, we've got the kitty cat. Let's get to him because he's one of my favorites. And I don't think any of these are animals. I think these are all insects. So unfortunately, these Poland Pops are not gonna count for this challenge. So we just have this one over here. Let's see what animals we can find. I actually don't see any animals. I am going to LA next week though. Maybe we should get this suitcase one for LA. I'll do like an entire video, whether it be a TikTok, an Instagram reel, or a short of all of the fidgets that I'm bringing to LA, but this might have to make it into the mix. And with this thing here, oh my gosh, we've got all of these little guys. Let's get the piggy because he is so cute. Obviously a pup in a costume counts. I feel like this one almost counts two times because it is a guinea pig and a lion. So that's like two in one. Other than that, oh, here we go. Here's some more little finger puppets. I feel like there are so many dinosaur fidgets. Should we do an entire dinosaur only fidget challenge? Here is another kitty cat. Okay, so this is technically a guinea pig in a costume and this one is a pup in a costume. So it's like two different fidgets. So let's pull these over here, pop them in. And I saw one more over here. The little fishy. Oh, this will be perfect for the insect one. So let me know down in the comments if you want to see that. Here we've got the polar bear and the crazy cat lady. And then we've got some puppies. So many. Oh my gosh. And the normals. Okay. Those are clouds. Those don't count. Wait, it says unicorn. Wait a minute. It's mostly unicorn. Only one cloud. So that counts too. Because I can barely carry all of this. My hands are... Oh shoot. I'm leaving this one. Okay. Okay. I can like barely carry all the fidgets that I'm finding. This might be our best fidget challenge ever. I just realized I forgot this frog. And over here, I do not think I see anything. So one last look around. I think we have finally found every single animal fidget here at Fidget Headquarters. So now it is time to count and see if I truly did find more fidgets in this challenge than in any other. So we don't have just one, but we have two. I can't even lift this basket, guys. Overflowing baskets of animal fidgets. So we're gonna count them real quick to see how many we found. This could take a while, stay tuned. One, two, three. Five, 56, and 57. We found 57 animal themed fidgets here at the teacher's lounge, and that might be one of our best hauls ever. I do believe we did better in just like one other video, but this is definitely up in the top 10. I cannot believe how many we were able to find. I think my favorite is going to have to be the crazy cat lady mochis. These crack me up every single time. I love cats, Charlie loves mochis, and I think this one is just so perfect. So let me know guys, did I do better or worse than you thought I was going to do? And do not forget guys, as I stated earlier, you too can be shopping all of these fidgets online at fidget dash hq.com use code sierra for 10 percent off and you can enjoy just as many fidgets as me if you like this video i'd like it if you gave it a thumbs up and if you loved it i would love it if you would subscribe i hope you guys have a wonderful day let me know down in the comments what my next challenge should be and don't forget wash your hands bye guys you and i till the